I, I'm telling you that in my spirit this morning, I heard the Lord and immediately my mind went to this verse. He said, the reason that people are not receiving the fullness of what I want them to have is lack of desire. But tell them if they'll begin to desire. Desire accepts no defeat. Desire absolutely accepts nothing but victory. One translation said consuming passion, unrelenting, undying drive, insatiable hunger, unquenchable thirst, intense fervency. Desire is the difference between winners and losers. Jesus wasn't some casual Christian. He prayed with strong desire, strong crying, strong weeping, strong intercession. Desire. I believe God is speaking to us today. I must work while it's day. Whatever you want, you can produce if you desire. There's no place that you can quit desiring God, desiring spiritual things. There's no quitting place. I want to ask you something that Jesus asked the man who had been laying at the pool for 38 years. He said, do you want to be healed? And, and, and listen to his answer. Well... Yeah, Lord, I want it, but there's no man to put me in. Somebody always pushes me back. Somebody always keeps me out. Somebody always, it's people's fault, people, people. If it weren't for the people that messed me up, if I'd have just had the right daddy, if I'd have just had a good family, if I'd have just said, if that man wouldn't have left me, oh, I've, oh, oh, Jesus said, do you want to be healed? I'm not interested in what people have done to you, how they've held you back, let you down, disappointed you, forgot you, forsaken you. It has nothing to do with people. It has to do with do you desire? Do you desire? Do you want to be healed? 